feel like it's been the longest day ever. So we just got in. I just went to the monastery while Samantha was napping in the car. So let's do a quick grocery haul so you guys get an idea of what I usually pick up. Some chips, harvest chips, we haven't had in forever. And they finally had one chicken stock. I wanted to get this for the car. Eat EnviroSense, sense made safer, so it's non toxic, no respiratory sanitizers. Sensitizers, I like sanitizers. Two fragrance diffusers and two elastic loops. So it was the smell black vanilla and mandarin. Holy but Jesus, it smells so good. Love bacon, Stan loves bacon. So I got the black label brown sugar thick bacon cut. Mm. So good. These or like produce, so garlic. We got a cucumber, onions, two lemons, a half jar bag, and an orange chocolate cake. Cilantro, because they asked for rosemary. More rice vinegar, because we always use that. The khaki, because it was finishing. They were on sale, they were like mini to-go's. I used to get these chocolates at Rosetto in Italy, and I love them. Got Savannah some raisins, because she usually likes raisins from the raisin brand. Right, red wine vinegar. I feel like every recipe I looked up always asks for that, and I don't have that. Sour cream, because you remember what happened yesterday. What happened? You sure I didn't rip my pants? You ripped them? You sure I didn't rip them? You say you, I didn't rip them outside, right? But I told you, I think I think I heard it, right? Yeah. And you told me nothing happened. I checked your ass. I didn't see nothing. Babe, I really do think I ripped my pants. These are lucky bread. Oh no, they're old. I asked you, and I've been walking around going to the floor todo el día. I literally asked you. <laughs> Turn around. No. <laughs> Babe, no, like. Babe, I literally asked you. Babe, I genuinely. <laughs> wow, babe, you did like a good deep one. No, no, <laughs> Look at this one over here. <laughs> I don't walk that way. Exactly, you see it. Okay, well, these were on sale and they were pushed Good morning, guys. So it is Friday, January 5th. We're about to make breakfast. Savannah got up like around 7 ish. Um, we laid in bed and then I was just like doing stuff upstairs, fixing her room. I haven't fixed ours yet. Changing her, changing her diaper, brushing her teeth. Um, I have like these little good molecules, hydro gel, caffeine eye patches because my um, eye bags. All oh, eye bags. Well, yeah, they're like intense. So we're gonna make breakfast. Oh, feel the cold, honestly. I think it's like this weekend. It's supposed to snow. I make myself the egg bites from Trader Joe's. You guys know how I feel about these. These are so good. It says you can heat them in 60 seconds in the microwave. I prefer these in the air fryer. Microwave, I don't know. It's just, it's just not giving. Even though I'm pretty sure when you get these like at Dunkin' and um, other places, they're in the microwave. Unless it's like those little ovens. Savannah, a little egg. So let's make this breakfast and yeah, see what else we have to do. Take down the garland from there. It just looks so bare. I added these two candles here, pillar candles. So when I light them, I like the aesthetic of them. Um, I added the guest room <laughs> lamp there because it's cute. I wanted something different, but right now everything looks so expensive and we're moving soon, so I'm not really wanting to invest in pieces just yet. Some sort of plant here, but then I know I always have a plant here, so I don't know. But once again, I am moving soon, so I can't necessarily decorate according to this room. Do you get what I mean? Stove's not on, so don't worry. You're cooking your bracelets. The living room, my heater's on, so of course it's gonna sound like AZ, but this is what it is now, and I feel like it looks so bare. I feel like I need something there or something here, and then there's just so much floor showing. I feel like I need a rug. So I think I'm gonna go get a rug today. <laughs> I honestly don't know, but I really want one. And then, yeah, I just, I don't know if, it just looks so naked there. And we have pieces, but I don't necessarily think I want those pieces on there. I feel like it has to be like something different. And then here, I feel like this is okay. This is fine. And then like I ended up putting the dog's like toy basket out here. 
but I feel like something's missing here. Here, I had an idea for it, but once again, I don't want to invest in it because we're going to be moving soon. But I was thinking, like, my friend actually has, like, two um, shelf units on top of her couch, and I love the way it looked, and it really would work for this space. But I don't know. I'm still undecided. That's, like, the thing about, like, being military. You move into so many different places that you, like, cater to a certain house, and then, like, it might not work in another house. So that's why I'm, that's why I'm just kind of, like, do I decorate for it? A rug I definitely think I'm going to get because I feel like that I could use anywhere no matter if it's in my in my room or the living room or anywhere else. Right, we gotta take this because if not it's gonna melt. Alright we can't cook we can't cook your numbers. Are you trying to cook your numbers? I don't know. You don't know? Okay put your numbers on. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah. You got it in. Oops, which is perfectly fine. I know. I know you fall on that floor. Another reason why I wanted a carpet is because for some reason the floor in front of our um, fireplace is super slippery. Like I don't know what they did to the floor, but it's a slippery floor and I've fallen. Savannah has slipped and I think right now she wants to run and she fell hard. She was crying. For those days, I already feel this it. This guy literally just came on my thing. I think I'm definitely gonna have to step outside, probably go to Costco and just pick up some fruits and stuff like that so we can have things in the house just in case. Let's get ready. Um, this is how my egg bites turned out. I don't know if it's gonna focus on there with the sun, but so delicious. These Stanley stacking pints, y'all, you need these. If you like the Stanleys and all that stuff, this is so elite. My husband and I have them from the Valentine's collection from Target. I got the Cosmo Pink, I got him the black one, and literally we've been drinking everything out of this. Like, if it's not in this, we don't want it. Passion fruit, so fucking good. I have to change myself, because Savannah's already dressed. And we'll head out for the day, guys. So, here we go. Someone likes the raisins, you want more? More? You want more raisins? I did say I was gonna sit down and eat, but a package for my sister just arrived. So I have to open it. You can't tell me I have a package at my door and not open it. Ooh, what is this? Oh my god, this is so cute. <gasps> Obsessed. Oh my god. I love it. American Eagle, I love Ari. Oh my gosh. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. And then they got Jose a cute American Eagle t-shirt. I absolutely love American Eagle t-shirts. They just have like this quality to them that is just like extra nice. Like it's, it feels so good. I compare t-shirts, I know this sounds crazy, but I'm just a t-shirt kind of gal and I love to always compare. Like if you go to like, I think it's like Abercrombie, Hollister, um, American Eagle, their t-shirts are just like such a thick, material and they last and then my sister got her this cute little doll look how cute she is i had gotten my nephew these pjs and then he outgrew them so she's like do you want them and i'm like yeah i'll put these on savannah i don't care pjs are pjs and oh my gosh my grandmother's scarf so cute. oh i'm so happy thank you sissy thank you juan and ryan love you and thank you grandma i don't think she watches my videos but um yeah I'm so happy. I love Jose's shirt. I'm like, boy, I'm gonna wear your shirt too. Super cute. That sweater, I feel like I need to wear it today because it just looks so warm. But all right, let's go and all right. I've had these on for God knows how long. Let's take these off. I think we're good. I think we've been saved. We're back. Let's fix it while she's chillaxing her chair. I love going to the fiber bag. I'm just trying to see what I didn't use, what I need to restock. We're thing and then just put a diaper in there. Skip Hop goes with me everywhere and I like that it has this little handle so just in case I don't want to bring anything but this like from my car I just tilt her around. She has little poop bags in here just in case because sometimes her poops or well, most of the time her poops are stanky. So I like to put them in there. A little zipper here. I usually always have wet ones in there, which I need to restock wipes. So I usually get the dapple hands and face wipes, but they're always sold out online and you can find those in stores. 
And then I recently got these from Target, the Up, Up, Up and Up, compared to Johnson's Baby Hand and Face Wipes. These, I guess it's like the generic smell of wipes, and I hate it. I'm not a fan, so I just need to finish these off. Here, I usually have an extra diaper or two. I need to restock that. A set of, I have clothes, a little outfit just in case. This is Dermavon. I believe if something happens, it's just like a glue, I think. Correct me, I might be absolutely fucking wrong. I'm gonna put her spoon in here, her hand sanitizer. I have the Baby Bum hand sanitizer in free coconut. She loves it and she knows the whole gist of like spray spray and red red. Pouches, pouches are so important. So I always keep a pouch for two and then she likes these Kirkland's chewy and soft bars. So I like to have snacks for her. And then we have a bib. I like these bibs, even though she hates wearing a bib because sometimes she has some cute outfits. I'm like, girl, we're not dirty, that is crazy. I'm gonna go wash her bottle because I'm constantly washing these things because, yeah, they get dirty, so let me go wash them. So like I told you, I have these two treats in here for her, but I packed up some extra bonus treats, which are the chips and pretzels. I do have containers for these, but I think they might be in the car. We'll have this one. This area of hers is always a mess, and I have this one. But I wanted to just use some Ziploc bags. It is easier, guys. So, yeah, her diaper bag is ready to go. Bottle has been washed. All right, in. so we just got back. Never told you guys I was stepping out, but your girl stepped out. Got a good text from my husband. Right. So we just went to Trady's. I did go to Marshall's first. I got a Peloton sweater on clearance, like extra clearance, but I left it in the car. I went to Home Goods last minute after this because I was like, do I go home? Do I stay? Why did this? For one second, I'm like looking at the dates on these salads and it's like next week. They gotta be done, but that's fine because they usually get bad after a while. So I did up a little vino at Trady's. This is Giardino. Hopefully it's good. DOC. But I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. In this section, we got some good stuff. So I was super excited because I wanted to try that sleepy cocktail again. Jacqueline Hill just did like a little TikTok about it. And she does like a little cocktail. So the actual brand that starts with a K, it's like nine dollars. This was like five bucks. So we doing this one tonight. Then we have some sesame crunch chop salad kit. I love this whenever we have Asian inspired meals. Lemony arugula basil. This is my go-to. I could eat this whole thing mm, with some steak or chicken. I have some of these, but they're expired, so I bought a new one. Orzo is Savannah's go-to pasta whenever we make her stuff. I needed some extra tomatoes. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go to Costco today or tomorrow, so I just wanted some extra ones because the ones inside our fridge are not too good. These seaweed things are so good. I had them yesterday with our sushi bake. This is what Jose uses to make our Caesar salad dressing, which is bomb.com. All right, last minute I picked this one up so Jose can have it and he can put it in his bag. Honey walnut shrimp. So we don't follow the instructions on this, but I've been wanting this. I don't know, mm, like my mouth is watering already. These I think are brand new. I think they do bring these, but I don't know if they're like seasonal, but the Dutch griddle cakes. This just looks really good. So that'll probably be breakfast tomorrow. These little pastry puffs, mm, or pups so freaking good i've been wanting some almond croissants and i remember they had these so i picked up one box i'm gonna leave these overnight most likely the valentine's themed raviolis i picked up one keen bop in the wild so i had to re-up on that chicken taquitos in case i'm lazy and i don't want to make anything up on the soup dumpling and of course my butter chicken because i can't live without that spent like 80 bucks i think 80 something to feed savannah because she needs to go to nap now so uh, we'll see She's running around with the pups, so that's fine. But all right, guys, I'll get back with you guys later. So I failed to mention that I did pick up a rug. I got the Martha Stewart Brighton Collection, and this is how it's looking. It looked really nice. There was another one I loved, but I don't think it would go with our thing. 60 bucks. I feel like that's not a bad price. I don't lie. Jose has told me, let's hold off on getting a rug, but... I can't, like, luckily we may do with what we had. <laughs> and I managed to get the rug, go pay, and be out. Oh, gosh. This rug, it is so netic. Okay, I love her. I don't know whether to turn her a little bit. Let's see, right here. Yeah, I think it's giving. I think it's giving. Let's wait to see what Jose says when he gets home. And I need to order grippers because we're going to fucking go flying. 
But all right, I think, I think it's good, guys. All right, I'm so happy with that purchase, and I'm so down because I went out to the car and I did not pick up a Peloton sweater that I'm talking about. All right, I'm happy with the rug. I just hope this guy likes it too. Ugh. I have to just make the plunge. I'm probably gonna sit down and look if there's other rug options online, but I really like this one. I think it's so freaking cute. I just did a video about these from the Target Bull by Playground. So cute. I'm not a fan of how they put the bottom, like this huge wording. It just says not, not dishwasher safe, not microwave safe. Can't live without my cherry cook. So, so I'm gonna put these on the stove top. I did I did this on Vlogmas, so if you guys want, I'll probably link that down below so you guys can watch it. But I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna sit I'm down to bed late. And then Savannah woke up like about two or three hours later. And girlfriend didn't want to go to sleep basically. So that was rough. I'm 7 54 and it literally is still like dark outside. It's awesome. That try and be Peanut butter. That's my more too. Where my honey got like this? Oh, but it'll do. I really want it. So honey. Mm. Mm -mm. I really wasn't a fan. I don't know. This yogurt was really thick. I, we used to get this one. But I wasn't. I wasn't fond of it today. Oh my gosh. I could have seen that baby. The day is just, <laughs> it's not giving. It is raining. Um, hopefully she'll wake up soon. But she did go down a little bit earlier than usual. This tomato is salmon that Jose had cured for us. So I want extra like sushi stuff. But yeah, it is raining. I prefer it in snow, but I get worried that it's gonna be like, rain and then it might be icy and it might freeze so yeah um all right guys stay tuned see what we make because i'm starving now so like not out of amazon package so i'm excited vacuum tech gripper for rugs so put that in the rug over there look how cool that is it's a clear case and it's like a lifesaver. This is like super dingy now, and they were super inexpensive. I just want to clean up my watch. Cute. Just that I love having like these little um, plastic coverings, just because I remember I used to have like a screen protector in my old one and great my battery died, so I have to charge that. But let's take a look. Cute. I definitely need to remove some likes so i guess i'm gonna do that exactly what i was going for plastic so don't judge all right excited I have this all linked in my amazon store friends and these just in case for house stuff and we're back so i managed to do the watch i'm so excited i'm so proud of myself never doubt yourself just try it doesn't work out then ask someone to help you but i did it look how cute Honestly, I wanted like a two-tone and I feel like it just looks good Two, three things First I added the grippers onto the rug so excited. This is what it definitely needed you heard guys I just added a um, Shorts of her. Let me put her in the light so you can see her in all her glory. Oh there So freaking cute. I initially wanted a black one of those but I really don't have like a nice neutral like cream color and I feel like this is gonna be so perfect now and even like summer and spring it is nice I kind of laugh because this has mini shoulder bag like this shit's huge <laughs> but it's water resistant you can adjust the shoulders it is just giving I love the pockets it's just great honestly I feel like I can fit diapers in here wipes all the shit bam but yeah so cute a haul on things i got like on clearance after like i think it was like after christmas or new year's y'all i got these i think these are threshold pillows these boucle pillows so nice three dollars these retail for thirty dollars guys <laughs> i was on a mission i went i didn't even know these were part of it so many tiktokers were putting videos out of like what to keep your eye out for this had not been shown yet and 
And all of a sudden, I was like, yo, let me just fucking scan every freaking pillow. When I scanned these, I about gasped. There was no tag reference. There was nothing on there that said it was going to be on sale. <laughs> I paid $6 for the two of them. Trust me, I tried to look for more, but I'm pretty sure someone <laughs> figured it out. So I feel like they fit perfectly. These are stuff I have to put away as well. I'll show you that too. This one, I was really tempted to get the, the little checkered heart ones for Valentine's Day. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to get my likely at Target because I'm there 24 fucking 7. And yeah, I'm so excited. I'm just really happy that I finally got it. And I figured out how to kind of like make that work instead of having it over here overlapping. Long story short, today Target was doing, I think it was like 20% off um, Casa Luna and I think like any bedding. So, let's talk about these shams. On our wedding registry, we have put some quilts and some like bedding stuff. I prefer quilts just because Jose gets really hot and then I just layer with blankets. So, I had initially added this um, velvet channel stitch um, quilt, right? Not my freaking heater starting. I'm sure I'm gonna elevate my voice. Um, we got the quilt, we got this one, and then we got the other one. I wanted the shams for the other one. I like to have everything matching, but the shams were full price. And then what I hate about them is they never sell these in twos. It's always a single freaking sham. So you're paying $20 per sham. Like, no, that's a scam. <laughs> I was like, they're going to go on sale. So the first one that I got as gift, they came on sale, but then they were sold out. And I was like, of course, why would they be in stock? And then I went to Target, couldn't find them, and I just gave up on that. And then I was like, you know what? I can get these because, one, I have this exact quilt, and then the quilt initially has some green in it, so I feel like it'll kind of, like, it works. It doesn't have to be exact. So instead of wasting, like, what? $40 or more on double shams. I just got these two. These ended up coming out to, I think it was 30, which I was like, that's whatever, because I ended up going to Home Goods and I realized Home Goods sells shams, which I didn't even put two and two together. Um, and they sell them in two packs, smart people. And they were, I think, like $24.99 or something along that. And I was like, fine, that's whatever. But yeah, I'm really excited because they have them in stock at my local Target. And so yeah, I was gonna I was gonna get these shipped, this with the doormat. And I was like, you know what? Let me just pick it up. That'll be like our outing for the day. So yeah, I'm really excited because now I can use like this quilt and I can take out the other quilts. I initially had it out, but I put it away because it was driving me insane not having shams for it. So yeah, enough rambling. Let's get this, let's put these things away and let's kind of pick up before I wake up Savannah because it's about to be four and I'm probably gonna wake her up. And she's probably gonna hate me. And she's probably... I also haven't taken this cup out, but I should. And I got this for a major steal. Like how adorable that is. So of course I got the letter S for Savannah, my baby. Yeah, super cute. I don't know if I'm gonna leave it out or just pack it up for the holidays because obviously it's a seasonal one, but look how adorable that is. This is 14, it's down to 9.95. And then I have like another discount. Like, so cute. And I figured like once she gets older, she can keep it for herself if she wants. But I'm so excited for this. We had a bunch of like other ones, but I want the Valentine's Day ones because I'm just like that. I'll get back with you guys later on. And thank you for joining me on my quick little hauls and all that shebang.